just about ready to roll here. And on the hill in this one, number 74. Now it's the right fielder, Ronald Acuna Jr. Pitch. And there's ball four. I don't think he really wanted to pitch to him right there anyhow. Acuna runs. Ball outside. Throw to second. Save. 2-2 Two -two now. Fly ball to right. Matos settles under it. Brings it in. Runner tagging for third. And he makes it up to third with one away. Smoked on the ground a second. Fires over to Davis, but the go-ahead run comes in to score. Matt Olson up to the plate. Line drive, base hit. Swing, and that ball smashed on a line. And that is that. Back here at the ballpark, and today on the hill, Max Free. If you can control four or even five of those offerings, look out, hitters. It's going to be a go. tough We're day. Right He's really going to be able to keep those guys off balance. Austin yeah. Slater stands in. Shoots a line drive single into right center. And he works in a changeup. Line drive, and that's a base hit out into center field. And now runners at the corners, nobody out. A couple of singles back to back. Bounce to the left side. One gone, bottom half of the first. Next pitch is popped up. Riley drifts towards it. And there are two down. Pops out right there, and I tell you what, nobody's more frustrated with that at bat than him. Base hit right field. In there, he's safe. We're tied at one to the plate, and he's out. That ends the inning, but they do score a run here. New inning getting started. Swing and a line drive slicing into right field. He dives, but can't hang on. That's a base hit. Nicky Lopez up to the plate. He scored. This guy is a big contributor. Lined, and that's a base hit. Throw stops the lead runner at second. Two on and two out. Hard hit, base hit. Coming home. One runs in, Lopez on his horse, coming home. He scores as well, and they lead by two. He's safe at third, it's a two-run triple. Gets the job done as he brings home a pair. I'll tell you, man, it's such a good feeling when you smoke a line drive into the gap like that. I mean, sure, home runs are king, but I feel like nothing makes you feel like a true professional hitter. Bottom of the second. Now it's Paul DeYoung up to the plate. Love for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. On the ground to third. Whips it to first. Out. And a couple of quick outs. Good. That's to third. Riley fires to first. That ends the frame. Back here at Oracle Park, to ready to go for the last half of the innings. Gets his lead at first with nobody out. Talk about letting the ball travel so often in terms of a hitting approach, and that's a great example why right there. If he's willing to let that curveball get a little deeper into the zone before he commits, he's way more likely to recognize that it's making a beeline for the dirt. That's a base hit. Lead runner touches second, headed for third. The relay throw, and he's safe. So it's first and third with one down. Oh, can't pick it up cleanly. But he wins the foot race to first. Good job of knowing how much time he had there. Runner at second, two down. Waves at the bender for the strikeout. 
He's in a tough spot, had to make a great pitch, did it, got the strikeout, gets out of the jam. Clearly, he's happy with those results. And welcome back. And now the catcher comes up to him. Patrick Bailey. The pitch. Bailey. High fly ball out towards left field. Way back there. Into the bleachers and gone. He sends a rocket to left, and this game is tied. It's 3-3. He sent the first pitch over the wall. Must have dinner reservations because he wasn't wasting any time at the plate in that at bat. Casey Schmidt getting ready to hit. Nobody on. Here's a swing and a drive left field, and he knew it. That'll fire up the dugout, and they jump ahead in the fourth. It's 4-3. Four, the ground he steps on the bag out with room to spare and that's the inning but the long ball was working in this inning not once but twice it's now a 4-3 ball game you're watching Major League Baseball on the show back here at Oracle Park and he walked him how big a deal is that walk and swing right there to use the big part of the field. Everything was on time. He stayed balanced through the entire swing and just launched that one into center. Now a pretty big at bat coming up with a chance to even this ball game up. So Luke Jackson gets the call. He has a great slider with tons of movement. And they're all loaded up. Well, the stage has been set for this offense, Boo. It's all about creating opportunities, and this is one of them right here. And there's a hit. In from third is the tying run. It's 4-4. Four, four. That's hard hit on the line. Slater pulls it down. Runner tags from third. Runner from third into score. And it's now 5-4. That wasn't your standard sack fly. He barreled that baseball. Just couldn't get it to drop in. New pitcher coming on, the veteran, Scott Alexander. Well, one run game, and now Michael Harris. And I'm seeing very patient at bats out of him. One thing that really stands out is their chase rate. League out. And it gets by him. Runner on the goal. That's in for a strike. Throw to second and great jump. Swung on, belted. Back some more. Pulls it in on the warning track. Runner tags it second. On the ground. In plenty of time to first. Now two away as they get a run across. Welcome back. Bottom of the Leading inning. The tunnel very long in terms of depth and perception. Swing and this one's blasted. It's got a chance. And it's a one hopper off the wall. Should be extra bases. He's in at second with a one out double. the line base hit runner around third on his way to the plate he'll score easily and they trail by one always feels amazing getting a job done when the team needs you to come through he can wrap up the win and get himself a save tying run at first the winning run at the plate got him and that's the ball game The final one.